It's Master Mino here. Back with another video. Today we're going to be doing some live battles. Even though I didn't get 10 likes, but what I'll do is do this first time, and, and if this gets 10 likes, I will do some more live battles. So, see the reset. I did one battle already. Still having that level four tornado. That got me all the way to 4700, which is my new best. So we're gonna go ahead and push some more. Alright. Byron 2308 from Equator. So when they when they play aggressive with the pump, I like to do hog ice spirit if I don't have lightning in hand, which I don't. This guy's probably running some Three Musketeer deck, which is why I'm gonna do this. Now you guys may say, "No, man, because you could like do the Three Musketeers, man." But if they don't have elixir, then how will they even place it down? So that I won't have to waste six elixir on it. So that never even like alone. This guy should know that, and it's basically leaving it alone. So yeah, it's gonna do a ton, a ton of damage to his tower there. We have to get ready for this big. Push he has here probably has lightning too, um, but we can it. Oh, beautiful! What is this guy thinking? He knows I have tornado. He bet. Got him death damage. Will get to the tower. That's totally okay, cause he let our knight get to the tower, so I let his golem get to the tower. Just for fun. We're gonna go ahead place on hog here. Big push here. We're not gonna spend our one elixir ice spear. It's gonna be a waste. Cause whatever you place down is gonna get splatted by my executioner. Uh, looks like he's not doing anything for this. Both guys are targeting that targeting the hog, which is exactly what I want so that we can get to that tower. It looks like he he quit already, so we're gonna quit and lightning the four HP tower. Don't take that victory because he rage quit. I don't know why he would rage quit when he has got him, but you know, but this deck is really good with them. It's really good against Golems. Not not only makes me the rage quit, but it's like really good. Really good. So uh we're gonna go ahead and jump to my battle. Um fans are trying to hate uh play the battle we saw I I I don't wanna do that. But Alright, let's make our way to 4100 and that'll be the video. Alright. Spring skeletons. Um, I'll go for this skeleton. And it looks like he's playing a mortar deck. I've been seeing mortar decks constantly. It's really annoying, so. Yep, we're gonna have to place this down and place this down. Lava, don't freeze my ice spirit, please. Turn up everything to the center here. Skeleton's got some chip damage to the tower. He will cycle back to Minamoto. This is exactly why this deck is annoying. So we're just gonna place this down. That ice spirit's gonna do its good job for us. It's gonna freeze at night. Let it tank some more. Gonna place executioner here. Get rid of that mortar. Ooh, it's gonna rocket. Very aggressive right there. Very aggressive. Very aggressive rocket right there. We're gonna have to take this out hopefully. Alright. He's in the lead now, but we know he doesn't have anything, so do this, do this, get those skeletons too, hopefully. Yeah, we're gonna get some good damage on. I'm pushing to the other side, that's very aggressive by him. We're gonna go ahead and take care of that ice spirit, get that out of here. Place this down, counter that murder. One swing but a knight, absolutely perfect for us. Uh, I would place my hog here, but I just can't, so I'm just gonna go ahead and cycle to a little more. I'm not gonna let him do that. I'm gonna push and push until he dies. So, oh, Ice Spirit's gonna go for the hog, not the skeletons, which usually that doesn't happen. It usually targets the. Y you guys know what I mean. Both of them are targeting that, so we're gonna go ahead and place this down. Yep, 
Yes, we're gonna take everything out. We took one of his items that I don't know what we took out there, but we took out something that he placed right next to it, right next to the mortar here. This game is just one lightning away from victory. We could just lightning his mortar if you place it down. It's gonna absolutely obliterate it. Oh, I accidentally placed down the hog rider, but go ahead and lightning all this and oh dude. Oops. Okay. We just did something really nice for him. We missed on purpose. Gonna go ahead and lock, lock everything. Um And that's gonna be victory guys. He thinks he could be our lightning again with his knight. But sorry. I guess I just had more skill than you. I mean you don't even have skill. Mm -hmm. Wow. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and go for 4100 here guys. Level 12, um, sometimes level 12 sucks, cause you know, when I was at 4700, I went with level 12s all the time, and when I was at 4500, most of the level 12s had level 11 standards, so they're basically level 11s, but then I started bursting level 12s with level 7 epics, level 10 rares, and so this guy has level 11, he has level 11 standards, so it's okay, we might be able to win this victory. No shots from the Electro Wizard. Ooh, this is a good count, guys. I'm gonna place this there since he fireballed that. And we're gonna place down a hog rider to support our knight. He's gonna place down a miner there for some reason. We're gonna go ahead and get to the tower with that hog rider. Get some good damage on, guys. This is what I like. 300 damage each swing so that takes it down to 1120 and he has a tower at 2776 unless that minor gets there so it's gonna go ahead and place his his furnace so we're gonna lighten that furnace and right away I don't want to deal with that furnace if more fire spirits spawn nope only one so it's okay we're, we're, we're gonna come that fire spirit guys okay probably sitting at 10 elixir doesn't know what to do so we're gonna place split skeleton since we're sitting at 10 place executioner so we could kill everything he places down oh very aggressive watch this oh countered look at that counter you see that guys that's how you use this deck this is exactly how you're supposed to use the deck. Turn over everything to the other side so your executioner can target it. He thought my executioner wouldn't target his his uh his troops, but it targeted his elite barbarians. So yep, yeah, I'm sorry, but your elite barbarians just suck today. Okay, this is a very good counter. Nope, it's not, but we're gonna try anyway. Okay. It's gonna place E barge right now. Ooh, late on that musketeer. But there's minor out. One, one lightning away. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna push with the hog. If I push with the hog, he could place elite barbarians and probably win the game. So you don't want to waste elixir with this deck, guys. You want to get some good elixir trades. For example, uh, place knight there. Ooh, incredible value. Talk about that. I mean, all of that and. See guys, good, if you make good elixir trades, you will win the game. That's the, that's the whole point of using this deck. Is there, and the fan, I'm not hitting, so he's gonna go in the firewall, trying to get to that tower, but we're not gonna let him, so. I'm probably versing people who get a higher of Challenger 2. Maybe that's why I keep winning, but let's just check everyone's profile. I do that every time, and I'm sorry, I missed it, but. Um, Looks like his highest was 4450, so yeah, we're just beating people who are low, who are low on the league, and yeah, basically beating everyone who is low on the league, so yeah, it's too bad we can't go anywhere for the 600, because uh, I just woke up, so yeah, so that's it guys, we pushed to 4100. If this gets 10 likes, I will push some more. 